today we're going to read a story classic here in New Zealand, Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy, written by Lindley Dodd. Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy. Out of the gate and off for a walk went Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy. And Hercules Morse, as big as a horse. With Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy. Bottomly pots covered in spots. Hercules Morse, as big as a horse. And Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy. Muffin McClay like a bundle of hay, bottomly pots covered in spots, Hercules Morse as big as a horse, and Harry McCleary from Donaldson's Dairy. Bits of Maloney all skinny and bony, Muffin McClay like a bundle of hay, bottomly pots covered in spots, Hercules Morse as big as a horse. And Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy. Schnitzel von Crumb with a very low tum. Bits of Maloney or skinny and bony. Muffin McClay like a bundle of hay. Bottomly pots covered in spots. Hercules Morse as big as a horse. And Harry McLeary from Donaldson's Dairy. Can you see that there? You can see them following Harry McLeary. Tails in the air they trotted on down, past the shops in the park to the far end of town. They sniffed at the smells and they snooped at each door, when suddenly, out of the shadows, they saw... Scarface Claw, the toughest Tom in town! <coughs> said Scarface Claw. Off with a yell, a wail and a howl, a scatter of paws and a clatter of claws. Went Snitzel von Crumb with a very low tum. Bits of Maloney or skinny and bony. Muffin McClay like a bundle of hay. Bottomly pots covered in spots. Hercules Morse as big as a horse. And Harry McCleary from Donaldson's Dairy. Straight back home to bed. And that's the end of the story. Hope you enjoyed it.